Hey, welcome to Blanche Flower. Um, obviously, this is a new adventure for you from compared to last season where you were at Balamina on loan for a while, and obviously, you were previously at Cliftonville too, as well. Yep. Like to personally, obviously, and obviously, the club as well, would like to welcome you to Blanche Flower. And uh, I'm sure you're excited to get started uh, as quick as possible. Uh, uh, thank you very much. I'm um, obviously very excited to be here. Um, obviously, I'm known at Balamina last season, but it's good to get a fresh start now this mm. season and uh, go into the season knowing. Um, what our aims are and what you have to do to get there. Um, obviously, f um, quite close to a few people here, so I think that'll make it easier to get yeah. settled in. I mean, obviously, um, I'll just hold this here. <laughs> uh, you know, obviously, a few players we talked about before we we'll turn the camera on tonight. Um, what attracted you to the club? I mean, obviously, you said you knew Paul. Mm -hmm. You know, a few players. Was that sort of like a, another key factor for you wanting to come to the Welders, or was it just the overall sort of the attraction of the club? Uh, so first of all, it's uh, the setup's unbelievable. It's probably. Even if they're in the Premiership, they'd probably be the top one of the top facilities mm -hmm. in the Premiership. Um, obviously, played here a couple of seasons ago as well with uh, Cliftonville in the League Cup. So yeah. um, setup um, is a uh, class. So mm -hmm. and then obviously known Paul since I was a kid. Um, so met him when I was five or six, but worked with him really closely since I was probably fourteen or fifteen. So had a good five six year relationship with him as my manager. So. Yeah. I know what I'm getting with Paul, and then obviously um, I'm really close with my teammates as well, so that all helps totally. you. And I mean, obviously, if, if you have a Premiership experience, then you can obviously bring that down into the Championship. I mean, yep. obviously, you know yourself, the Championship's one of them competitively. I mean, look at the seasons just passed, there. it was one of them seasons that uh, mm -hmm. was just you couldn't know what was going to happen next one minute. You're, you'd be sitting fifth or sixth, and then you'd be top. Yeah. But that's the whole the best thing about the Championship, and obviously, I'm sure you're relishing the challenge for, yeah. for next season coming ahead. It's always going to be difficult coming here. You know, championships really physical league. Mm. Um, probably maybe even more physical in the Premiership. So you're going to have to battle every game and win the right to play, as yeah. everyone says. So, but obviously then on the other side as well. Um, I know that I'm coming here to a club that wants to play with the ball. So mm. I'm hoping that suits my my style of play and we can uh, get a few wins like that. Yeah. For anybody who doesn't know who you are, I mean, what's sort of what's your sort of favourite position? I mean, where do, you, where do you see your comfort zone on the pitch? Um, centre half is my main position, mm. yeah. Um, probably most uh, comfortable playing in the back four, but played a back three all last season as well. So um, centre half, yeah, I like to get on the ball and play. And then obviously um, like to use my, my height and my physical presence as well and try and yeah. be dominant in the air and stuff as well. I mean, Paul is trying to build more of a youthful side here. I mean, obviously yourself being quite young as well, he's got a lot of younger players in the squad as well, you say, you know. Um, obviously, the, the challenge for this season obviously is to get higher than what we were. And I'm sure you're trying to come in now to obviously contribute you yourself towards that and try and get the table, us up the table more than what we were the last two seasons. Uh, I think it's always good to have a mix of uh, experience in the squad. Mm. I know we've got a really young squad, but I think there's obviously older players as well who've got that experience in the Irish League. So I think the mix will be good for us. And uh, I think if we've got the, the drive and the hunger from the young players as well, we'll, we won't be far away.